Now I'm going to pick up uh, one of my favorite shields. Uh, I'm going to be using the shower, shower, tower shield um, for my next, for this rest of this playthrough, which you get after beating uh, Ornstein. <clears throat> I'm sorry, the old dragon slayer. And uh, he hasn't been confirmed as Ornstein yet. Um, I'm actually going to get a shield that has a 100% physical block, which there really isn't that many shields in this game that have that much. Uh, like Dark Souls, just the first Dark Souls, uh, like, seemed like the majority of the shields you got had 100% physical damage block, but um, stuff like, uh, I don't know, uh, Just like many of the shields in this game don't have 100% physical damage, which I don't know, it's kind of stupid to me. One of my favorite shields is actually one of the ugliest shields in this game. It's um, the uh, the Germ Warrior. Uh, what is it? The Germ Warrior shield, the Great Shield. Um, it has like 100% physical damage and 100% uh, fire damage. So, uh, fighting those stupid flame salamanders. God, I hate those stupid salamanders. They, for some reason, like, they auto-walk. Like, no matter what you do, you will not be able to avoid them. Uh, anyway, uh, go ahead. We're going to go ahead and uh, buy the rest of this guy's uh, Titanite shards. Uh, and then we're going to... Um, crap. Let me buy two maces. And then we're going to upgrade both these maces. I'm debating on whether to get the Pursuer's Ultra Great Sword because it's a really good weapon. Um, Correct. It's just, you know. a little bit more souls. Did I pick up any souls back there? Did I pick up any souls? Let's see. No? No, I didn't. Uh, yeah, this should be good for... You know what? Let's not do uh, Skeleton Lords. Let's do uh, uh, Ruined Sentinels. Let's change that to... Uh... So, uh, power stance, what it is, it's basically like, you know how you have attacks like these, uh, go back and forth between these, you can, uh, if you hold the Y button or the, what is it, the, for PlayStation triangle button, because I'm, I'm using an Xbox controller, because that's just what I'm used to, uh, but if you get a uh, PlayStation co controller, you press a triangle, hold it, and you get into power stance mode, and so power stance mode, you can, uh, Double hit, there's your uh, normal attack, or your weak attack, and then your strong attack is kind of like you're playing the drums. Like, you know, like a rim shot, like... You know. But, uh, we're gonna go to uh, the Lost Pestile, and we're gonna fight the Ruined Sentinels. No, don't wanna go there. I felt so good parrying the pursuer. I felt so good. I just wish I got to that uh, the ballista earlier than I did, because that would have been like so awesome. I was just kind of shocked by how I did that. Oh, okay. Forgot about those guys. Um, I'm not really gonna upgrade any armor that I have. I'm probably gonna get the uh, elite knight armor. Just because it's, you know, it's a pretty good, pretty decent armor. Um, but I'm going to wait until I get Vengarl's armor. I'm not going to get his headpiece because, you know, I see everyone wearing it. And it's kind of like, you know, uh, if everybody's doing it, you know, I don't, I don't really want to do it. But, I mean, I don't know how much uh, damage his helmet has. I examined it. Let me, let me, okay, there we go. Um... I'm probably gonna stick with the uh, like maybe the Hide Knight Iron Mask or uh, you no, know, just a good helmet, a good decent helmet. What my uh, my sorcerer build 
is wearing the Hexer's hood and along with Vingarl's armor. I think the Drain Lake armor too. Let's go ahead and sit here. No, I don't want to travel. Um, I don't think I'm going to be doing anyone's storylines through this playthrough. I just don't really feel like it. But I'm kind of debating on whether keeping the or keeping with the, my great sword uh, tower shield build or go with the pursuer's ultra great sword. Um. I don't know, I just had to see the stats of the weapons. I love the uh, great sword and I love the clubs, but uh God. It's not a good way to uh start my lost best deal, whatever. Should she give you something? They say, I'm sorry, I thought. You, I don't. You, I come, don't hesitate to call. Never mind. Uh, she says, don't hesitate to call her, but you know, she's never. I know she, I know she fights you in some battles. Like I think she fights you on uh, the rotten and uh, something else. Uh, of these large titanite shards but um you summon a pilgrim bell clear for this fight but i really don't i don't know if i should let's just see let's see if i need to summon somebody for this fight um i've noticed something whenever you uh beat say uh Nishandra, a lot of the enemies like will despawn in an area and some enemies enemies will uh, spawn in another area not like uh new game new game new game plus or anything just it's just i don't know i don't know what i'm saying like say uh back at that uh Back at that uh, ladder, uh, there was a dude. They were one of those royal. What? Where'd they go? I don't know. Spell clear has all the good uh, attacks. Summon her. What's up, Broski? Let's, uh, let's do this thing. You gonna, you gonna help me? There we go. Here's that sunlock. Not sunlock, but stun anyway. It makes me wonder like how many uh, how much health these guys have. The summons. Stupid spinning attack. Yeah, I always say this is like easy mode. 
when you have uh, dual maces. Oh god. That's just there we go. Bam bam. Yeah. Thank you, Belle Claire. Thank you very much. Okay, they're dead. They're dead. Don't we're good. They're dead. You're okay. <laughs> 